Welcome, people. Um, right, we are Mount Olympus. Yes, I think it's the mountains of the of the Greek gods, Zeus and that. Um, <laughs> anyway, we got here yesterday. We had a little mooch, little family mooch yesterday, um, and then this morning we've not filmed any of this, so this is why I'm telling you. Uh, we had to take Hoochie to the vet. His eyes wasn't looking too good. He was, he was looking a bit of discomfort. So we've come back and I'm now going to go take a little mince at Mount Olympus. So on my own though, no cookie, no Hoochie, no Gibbo. Uh, so yeah, I thought I would take you with me. We'll see what we see. I'm out of breath already. I thought I was a fit young lad. <laughs> That's good. about 1700 meters so we've got about 300 meters to go until the refuge uh, the one thing I with the uh, you know the mist and that getting quite high now and I know I'm sure I read somewhere that like Olympus is like the mountain of Zeus or something and it actually feels like I'm walking up doing with the gods it's that sounds quite dramatic, or maybe mel <laughs> melodramatic, but yeah, man, this is this is pretty awesome. Uh, just yeah, you can see by the viz behind me is it's good. Zeus coming for you. <laughs> Wow. You're not a statue, are you? <laughs> you okay? Don't worry. Hello. Where are you off to, dude? Oh, is it something I said? Hey! <laughs> oh, you're having a little poopsie. Wow. You're awesome, dude. Is this the right way to the refuge? <laughs> Alright. I'll catch you later. Well, this is where we get to. This isn't, I'm sure this isn't the refuge, surely. There's no signs. I imagine a refuge to be bigger. I'm sure I read somewhere that it can like 180 people. <laughs> Unless that's like a TARDIS or something. Uh, I can't see any, any markings for this uh, E4. Oh, I've got a phone signal though, so that's a plus. Um, <laughs> Hi, right, man. We'll have a little look round. I was going to get the drone up, but ah, not worth it, is it? Clagged in. But anyway, 
Let's have a look, look, little look around, see if we can find a path. If not, I'll head back down. Ugh. So, <laughs> it is hardly the view I was looking for. However, we'll still have a wet. We'll still have a bit of scram. And we'll still keep nice and warm. How does that sound? Uh -huh. Had to don the old gloves. Freezing up here, actually. Uh, obviously, shorts are still okay, but gloves. Essential. Oh. Next up, some coffee. Oh, it's the good stuff right there. Black coffee, man, can't beat it. And then, if you've watched our videos before, uh, some of Gibbo's uh, famous, famous banana, oats, flapjacks, but this time, a few raisins chucked in as well. Mm. That's so good. Oh, wow. <clears throat> Sun's peeking its head through. Look at this. I don't even know if the camera will pick it up nicely, but look at that. Oh man. Amazing. Oh. I don't know if you can pick that cloud come cloud coming up. Sun's peeking its head through up there. What a treat. What a treat. I think this is the end of the road. Um, I'm gonna start heading down. Just look at that though. Stunners, man, stunners. I wanna see you around. Look at this. I've always loved the saying, it's not about the destination, it's about the journey. And this hike up Mount Olympus is a prime example of that. Did I get to my destination? No. Was the journey worth it? Absolutely. And that is just like life. The destination is never guaranteed, but the journey is. I'm not saying the destination isn't important. Obviously it is. But the journey, that's where the good bits happen. And unfortunately, from time to time, the bad bits too. 
But that's what makes life, well, life. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm not perfect at this. Too often, I get caught up in chasing my own goals and I don't appreciate the here and now. As with everything in life, it's a practice and van life has been a damn good teacher.